Good morning, everybody. On behalf of the team here at ARAG and also uh, the team at Stevenson today, a very, very warm welcome to you all uh, to the second of our Talk to the Experts series. Uh, this one obviously focusing on care. And uh, I do hope you are all keeping safe and well during this time. Um, so here's the agenda. Um, obviously, a very brief intro uh, from me. Uh, and then we'll hand over to Laura, who's going to look after um, the approach to risk management in the care sector at the moment. And of course, that being in line with CQC. Um, we'll also look at health and safety. Um, and Alison will be covering that off for us. Uh, then we'll move across to Adam, who um, is a frequent face on our webinars, who will look at the employment and, and key changes in the sector. Uh, and then we'll hand over to Julie, uh, finally, to look at contract and debt recovery um, and how that's panning out in the care sector at present. I'm going to be looking at the various and most important stages of the CQC's inspection enforcement procedures and, and how we manage the risk in these areas, particularly at the moment as we go through the pandemic. So I've explained there um, that we're basically going to touch on key legislation and uh, the main uh, regulator for health and safety, which is the health and safety executive. I've set out some of the key factors to consider when reporting incidents of health and safety to the HSE. And I'll highlight some of the more serious matters that are likely to attract the attention of the health and safety executive and then I'll finish with some basic compliance tips that I hope that you'll find helpful. It's important to seek professional advice so it's been a bit of a minefield for employers recently um, particularly with what's gone on and with the talk of a, a second lockdown etc it's something which is going to continue well into next year um, so there is no harm in picking up the phone to an advisor um, to double check that the policies and procedures and the processes being followed uh, are correct. I'm just going to run through for you a few basic but fundamental points that you need to bear in mind in dealing with your credit control processes and general debt recovery. Oh, wow. Uh, I mean, I'm completely blown away by the content there. So thank you all. Um, you know, I, I think as, as we've put there now, um, I mean, this is very, very clear that this is a sector under constant threat uh, of exposure. So I think now more than ever, care providers do need that protection 